So I'm going to talk about a little bit about a somewhat new project that I've been working on called Giggling Chi Tree. <laughs> <laughs> um, so the reason why I named it that was because I love to giggle, as most of you know. And, um, and I really love spreading the joy I get from the people and things that I love to others. So that's kind of why I chose to name, name it Giggling Chi Tree and the blending in with the nature aspect as well. So, Giggling Chi Tree brings together my love for nature, creativity, and energy. So, for my whole life, I have really been drawn to those three aspects, and I never knew how to bring them all together into one. So, I've been spending the last 30 years <laughs> trying to figure out how do I make it so I can do all of these things all the time. <laughs> so then came Giggling Chi Tree. Um, so I'm super passionate about permaculture, which Adrian talked about, um, along with natural building, energy, and art. And I get super excited about how these really empower me and really make me feel like I'm able to make a huge difference in the world. Um, they provide me with actionary tools that help me make the world a better place. And that's something I don't think you could put into words how amazing that feels to be able to have those tools. Um, so the reason why I started Giggling Chi Tree was so that I could have a way of sharing the techniques involved with these mediums with others to empower them to make a difference in their, li in their lives, in their communities, and in the world. So um, I always say that with permaculture, we can make the world a better place one garden at a time. And you don't know how the, how true this is until you experience <laughs> permaculture gardening for yourself. Personally, permaculture is so much more than a gardening technique to me. It's a complete brain remapping and a way of life. It's totally changed the way I looked at everything in the world and showed me how to integrate all of the things I really love. So that's kind of how I came to be able to integrate all the things I really loved, um, was by learning permaculture. I see how I can merge nature, art, and energy into one, into one beautiful system, and I'm so happy to be blessed with the ability to share this with others. Um, so I guess that comes down to like what I do. So. Through Giggling Chi Tree, I am offering permaculture design and consultation, cob oven conventions, a variety, and a variety of workshops from permaculture basics, cob basics, cob benches, cob ovens, healing with herbs, intentional energy, Reiki, and creating with nature. So, and then I do, although I do charge for my services, I'm hoping we can slowly start to change our economic system and therefore I'm very open to the barter and trade of services and accept Calgary dollars. So this is something that I'm really passionate about. I realize that at this time, we haven't totally like integrated our economic system yet. So sometimes we still need to make a little bit of money, but the more that we can lead by example and start to you know, offer our services for energy trade, I think Matt's gonna talk about the time exchange after this. Um, then the more that we can start to slowly shift our economy the way that we, that I think we as a community want to see it go. Um, so where you can find me, so my website is gigglingchitree.com or Kim, spelled K-Y-M, at gigglingchitree. And then I also, you can find me at the area, if anyone's ever been to the area. It's an amazing demonstration community site where we have integrated permaculture techniques um, as well as building community through art and education as well. So I'm going to be starting um, becoming the garden coordinator there. So if you guys have any questions about how you can become involved with that project, it's something that I hold very close to my heart and couldn't be where it is today without everybody in the community kind of contributing in their own way to to build it and to make it available for everyone to come and enjoy. Um, and that email is meetmeattheareaca and or you can go to theareaca for more information about that project as well. 
That's it. Yeah.